Hello my loves, my name is Frankie and I'm a hairdresser and in today's video I'm going to be reviewing the Umberto Giannini Grow Long Shampoo and Conditioner range. Before we start, Umberto Giannini kindly gifted me these products which I'm so very grateful for but I want to let you know quickly that I was under no obligation to film this review. Everything you hear in this review is true and honest and my personal experience of these products. So Umberto Giannini says that a healthy scalp equals healthy hardworking roots. They go on to say that the Grow Long Shampoo is an anti-pollution shampoo that removes grime, buildup, and stimulates hair circulation. Vitamins and minerals from natural sources stimulate circulation to the roots for a healthy scalp and longer hair. Both of the products are cruelty-free, vegan, silicon-free, paraben-free, and gluten-free, and the conditioner is sulfate-free, but not the shampoo though. So the products contain a unique Umberto Giannini Caffeine Grow Complex. The caffeine and black coffee seed extract will stimulate circulation. Organic pea and sprout extract is said to accelerate hair growth and prolong hair life cycle. And seaweed and marine nutrients are included to make the hair healthy. They suggest that this product is suitable for all hair types, especially people trying to grow their hair. The recommended use for the shampoo is to massage it through wet hair and thoroughly rinse it and follow it with the Grow Long Conditioner. And the recommendation for the conditioner is to smooth it through damp hair to repair, moisturize and strengthen. It says to rinse the conditioner and follow it with the Grow Long Serum or the Wonder Blow Dry Spray. I didn't have either of those products and also I wanted to do the review based on just the shampoo and conditioner. So I haven't been using those, I've just been using the shampoo and conditioner. So. I've been using it as the label says, as recommended, but I've been doing two shampoos because that's generally what I do. I always wash my hair twice with shampoo and follow with conditioner. I've been doing that once a week, so it hasn't changed my routine, which is great because I don't like washing my hair more than once a week. I think my hair lasts really well between washes and if I can avoid washing it for even eight or nine days, that would be perfect. But with this shampoo and conditioner, I've been doing seven days, which is brilliant for me. I'm quite happy washing my my hair once every seven days so that's a big tick from me it hasn't changed my hair washing routine so my most favorite thing about this shampoo and conditioner is the smell and I feel like I say this a lot I really love luxurious smelling products and this is one of them it's got that really rich sort of cocoa butter caffeine almost the caffeine smell is really subtle but to be honest, it smells really sort of like chocolatey, cocoa buttery. Oh, it is honestly the best smell in the world. This one is gonna blow your head off. Honestly, favorite scent in the world. If every shampoo and conditioner could smell like this, I'd be a happy gal. It is so, so good and it just smells glorious and it really lifts the scent of your hair. It's not one of those products that where the scent kind of like washes out as you're rinsing the products out of your hair. You can definitely tell that someone has used it and my boyfriend's picked up on that as well and he's been using it as well because he loves the smell of it. I was like, you need to leave this stuff alone. This is for me. But he, every time I go in the bathroom, I can smell it and I'm like, you've you've been using it again oh man so one thing that I was originally worried about with the shampoo is that it does have sulfates in and I have a bit of a bad track record with sulfates usually they really dry up my scalp and they make it really flaky I feel like I have to wash my hair more and it's just like a whole cycle and that's why I tend to avoid sulfates in my shampoos and in my conditioners and in any products to be honest any hair care products but and this is a huge but I haven't had any extra problems with my scalp since using this product usually as soon as I start using a sulfate shampoo or conditioner I will break out in sort of like scabs across my scalp my scalp will get really flaky really sore really itchy and it's a whole thing it's a whole situation but these two products, although the shampoo has sulfates in, it doesn't dry my scalp out, it doesn't make it flaky. And I think that's because of this caffeine solution. So I think the caffeine has been sort of like um, penetrating the scalp and it has been increasing circulation, like it says that it does. And I think because of that, that has got rid of my dry and flaky scalp, which is a huge tick for me. I am really pleased about that. And it's also quite nice that I can use products that are high street price because a lot of products that are high street price 
don't have the vegan and the cruelty-free benefits. They don't have the sulfate-free benefits. They're sort of quite chemically products. And these products, although it has sulfates in, I know that I can use them because they haven't been drying my scalp out. That said, I have felt like maybe my hair could have been a little bit more moisturized and a little bit more repaired. It doesn't feel dry, but it's just been getting quite knotty since using these products. And that could be an accumulation of things, but it's probably down to the sulfates in the shampoo. Maybe without me knowing, the sulfates have kind of been drying out my hair a little bit, making it feel a little bit knottier. And that's fine. I've just been sort of brushing my hair using a little bit more oil alongside it but it is something to know if you are wanting to sort of keep your hair really strong, healthy and moisturized, maybe use a mask. Having said that, like I said earlier, Umberto Giannini do recommend that you use a serum or a, the Wonder Blowout Spray, I think it was called, after using these products. So that might be where they're sort of hoping that you'll get all of the moisture from. So that is one thing to note. My hair has felt me not drier, but maybe just a little bit sort of, not yet. So obviously, oh, I burnt my neck today. Can you see? Damn, that hurts. So obviously this range is called the Grow Long Shampoo and Conditioner range, and it is said to make your hair grow quicker. And I hadn't noticed any benefits from this. I think if you've been using something for a month, you're not gonna see inches of growth, but I have noticed that my fringe is feeling extra long. So last time I think I checked how long my fringe was, it was just below my nose, and now it's kind of coming all the way over my lips. I'm gonna try and find some sort of comparisons if we can just compare sort of videos that I did a month ago and my hair in this video and we'll be able to see maybe if there is a difference. So I'll do a little twirl now and we'll try and pull something from somewhere from the archives just to compare. Maybe it has grown. I think you can see a tiny little bit of difference in the length and maybe it has encouraged it to grow. I have definitely noticed that the caffeine has been stimulating my scalp and getting rid of dandruff, flakiness, itchiness. So if, if, if it's been doing that, then maybe it has been stimulating growth at the same time. I will continue to use it because there's a little bit left. So if there is any huge changes in the next few weeks, because that's probably how long it will last, I will jump on and let you guys know on, probably on my Instagram, I'll put my handle up here so you guys can head over there and have a look and keep up to date with everything that I do. So I would recommend this range to people with any hair type, dry, um, brittle, really moisturized natural hair, any kind of hair type that's just looking to one, smell fantastic, two, circulate the scalp a little bit better, get a little bit of caffeine stimulation up there. I think that is a really great benefit of the shampoo and conditioner and it's definitely be, definitely been doing something for me. It might not have necessarily been making my hair grow, but it has cleared up my itchiness, my flakiness. And that's amazing because usually sulfates in shampoos does do dirty things to my scalp. But yeah, I think overall, this is a shampoo and conditioner that I would definitely use again. I would 100% recommend it. And um, Umberto Giannini are a really sustainable brand. They do loads in terms of recycling and they are really good with cruelty-free and vegan aspects of their brand as well. All of their products are cruelty-free and vegan, which is amazing. And um, I just think that's how it should be now, especially with all of the things that are going on at the moment, it's good to know that there are no animal derived ingredients or products in our hair care. And why would you wanna put that on your hair? Honestly, like, you just wouldn't. So I think in total, I'm gonna to give this range four out of five stars. They would have got five stars if I had seen a little bit more benefits in the hair growth and if it, if it was actually sulfate free. I know the sulfates haven't affected me, but they're probably gonna affect some people and it would be great if the product was sulfate free. I also think the containers are great. They're really easy to use and they're really gorgeous colors. They look lovely in the bathroom. So that's a big thumbs up from me as well. So yeah, this range is gonna get a good four out of five stars. I hope you enjoyed this video guys and I will see you next week for my weekly upload. Bye.